In real life, when you're out and about, and somebody were to ask you, do you have a girlfriend, do you say yes? Um, would I say yes if somebody were to ask me about a girlfriend? Um. Do you know this person? Is that who we're looking for? I can't for? see. Hold on. Did we stab? Is that him? That's Elmo. Oh, boy. I don't know if that's who we're looking for, but I don't know why Dama would be is out there. Is that here. her? She's now looking in our direction. Let's find out what the story is. Um, Hello. What's going on? Before you get upset or anything, you know, I just want to tell you Charles isn't real. I'm Charles. I had a crush on you for like almost two years now. Um, <clears throat> I really like you. I could say I love you. I do love you. But no, I don't want to seem crazy or anything. Why did you keep it going so long? Because I was scared. I felt more comfortable being portraying this guy that I know you like, is know is your type. And he replied back to him. And, you know, it That's just some um, I'm telling you now to get it off my chest. I want to see if we can move on to be more than friends. I just want to clarify. In the very beginning, you made the profile. You found photos of Jaleel. Do you know who, that guy? I, or I don't know him. Just a random guy. Yeah. OK. So you made the Plain Fish account. You searched. You, what, you found her profile, yeah, and you and messaged her. Yeah. OK, got it. And who, who does know about this? Does anybody else know about uh, this? The only person I let know was Chad, because right. he was like, I just need you to do this favor for me. He was like, I got you, sis. I had to make at least one call to make it seem like he was a person. Right. When you first made the Plenty Fish account, what was the plan? Did I you have? I was just like, you know, trying to get a better, more intimate feeling with her. Like, get closer, like, more than a friend, like, type of way, you know? Did you ever try to come clean, or did you have a plan on how that was going to go? I thought about it, but then, like, I would always just get too scared to just be like, it's not what you think, and then I'll just never do it. It's like, I don't know, I was just scared. You're my best friend. I don't want to lose you as a friend, but I felt like if I can get Charles to make you some type of way, then I can definitely make you feel some type of way, too. This is like t too much. You shouldn't have did it this way. You came about it all wrong. I don't want to talk no more. Give us a second. My best friend betrayed me. She obviously cares about you a lot, has lots of feelings for you, some as friend, and uh, obviously more than that as well. So. She she screwed up. I don't know why she thought she had to do this and for this long. Exactly, for this long. That's why I'm really mad, because you took it so far. Definitely not the best way to go about this. I wasn't trying to intend to hurt her or do anything bad to her. She deserves somebody that'll cheer her right, because all these guys that she messes with, they do nothing for her. I mean, when she's texting this guy all day, every day, she doesn't realize that she press the send and your phone buzzes? I usually have it on Do Not Disturb or something. I don't let it be loud. Do you guys sleep in different rooms? We sleep in the same bed. You sleep in the same bed? Yeah, we have a queen size bed. Is that like torture for you? Sleeping in the same bed with her every night? Yeah. I'm gonna have to leave for a couple of days because I'm not, I need to get myself together. What do you want to do right now? I'm done talking. Well, why don't we go over there? Okay. All right. There's a lot to sift through here. Obviously, immediately, there's your living situation. We've never had this happen where a person's talking to someone who they live with. They sleep in the same bed. Yes, share a bed. I didn't realize that. We are happy to get you a room at our hotel. And then why don't we plan on meeting back up tomorrow? <sighs> All right, let's go. any consolation, he did the right thing. Oh, 
Oh my God. This a lift? Stop. Oh. Wait. Is that down? Yeah. That's some bull. Hey, Chelsea. I'm real. Hey, Neve. Lenny. Uh, well, welcome. We're all a little surprised. Yeah. Why? I think there were some oh. things that yeah. <laughs> might have seemed like maybe it wasn't going to be you coming out of the car. Like what? Never FaceTime. Yeah, I mean, just I mean, kind of hard with my schedule. You know, I have like, uh, you know, two different jobs and. I know, but a five minute FaceTime. Yeah. I think you're communicating something more right. by not doing it than just by, okay, hey, what's up? I'm a real person. Mm -hmm. I guess, yeah. I have a busy schedule too. Like, I do like two jobs plus my apprenticeship. Yeah. Um, you made a, a sort of allusion to there being something that you were concerned or maybe like insecure or uncertain about. Is there something that Chelsea doesn't know? No, it's just. I mean, she has seen me on TV, you know, like she has that understanding of me. Yeah, but like I never like had this idea of you or that you had to meet this expectation or anything. I'm just kind of concerned with, uh, you know, like how you picture me in your head versus, versus reality. Yeah. Where are you with your feelings towards Chelsea? You guys have obviously talked about being together and maybe starting a family, and, like and you're an adult. Utah and right. having kids Visiting. and getting married. There's some big words. I've I've never said that to somebody. Like it's just kind of that's that's major, you know. You don't just say those things. I mean, you know, it's kind of like a long distance thing. Flights are kind of expensive. I wanted to save up. That's kind of what I'm doing right now. I'm working like two jobs, you know, so I could possibly see her. But you knew plane tickets were expensive when you said, I want to come see you. Like, I can't tell if you really want to make it work or if you kind of like that it can't work and it's sort of nice that it's far enough away that like you can have it but not have to do too much. If, if it were possible for us to have a relationship, like I would totally be down. It's just, you know, the struggle of, you know, living so far away from each other. But I think you're jumping to the end of the game. Like, why didn't you ever draw her back? Yeah. You know? She did one for you. Well, I actually made one about six months ago for her, but I brought my wrong notebook today. Cool. gonna need like a full play-by-play. -play. I've been talking to Lenny pretty much every single day. Really? Yeah, it's like crazy because like everything's so different. Wow. Wow. It just kind of seemed like that wasn't where you felt with kind of that direction. Yeah, but he definitely like reflected on everything and then he started doing actual like attempts making things work. He really expressed himself emotionally and taking things more seriously. Wow, I, I did not see that coming. So is he your boyfriend? Um, yes. Oh <laughs> this makes you really happy to know that everything worked out. Yeah. You're the best. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye. We just spoke to Chelsea, and we're shocked. Yeah, I'm actually planning on uh, going up to see her uh, probably within the next month. Did something change for you after seeing her in person and like meeting her? It was such a strange, you know, situation to be in. I don't know. I feel like I didn't express how much I cared about her, you know, and I was kind of a little shy, you know. And now I'm actually trying to put forth the effort into actually creating a relationship with her. Why don't we? Why don't we come over here? That's Alexis. <sighs> so, Nicole. Mm -hmm. This is Jesus. And you are the person he's been talking to, mm -hmm. is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, what
what's been going on here? Because we got a whole story from Amanda. Clearly, you're not the girl no, in the pictures, Amanda right? Amanda made the profile. Okay. Wait, Amanda made I the made profile. Am Amanda made the profile years ago. She was doing this and that. She used to be my best friend. She's not anymore. Hold on. So you're saying that when Jesus started talking to Alexis, he was actually talking to Amanda? He was talking to her, and then I took over. How long have you been uh, the profile? Probably talking to him like a little over a year. So pretty much yeah. the whole time? Yeah. And it was you in the video chat, right? It was me. OK, so you are the catfish. Who's the girl in the Alexis profile? That's my cousin. All of her pictures. Oh, you use pictures of your cousin? Yes, that's quote unquote Alexis. And she knew you were using her pictures, or not? No, Amanda no. didn't tell her nothing. Amanda befriended her like a friend. You know, hey, let's do this together. I said, OK, you know, I agreed to it. And what about this Nicole person? That's my daughter, Nikki. You use pictures of your daughter? Yeah. Does your daughter know that you're using her pictures? No. What about your other daughter, Alyssa, that you told Jesus about? Yeah. Who's Alyssa? Aly that's Amanda's daughter. You said it was your daughter. Yeah, but don't yell at me. That's Amanda's daughter. Oh, right, Amanda. You said you guys got into a big fight because you sent pictures of her kids to some guy in prison. Uh, first of all, she's the one that gave me the pictures to send to them. Second of all, Amanda so did was. did send pictures of her daughter to, to nobody in prison. In prison. She was in this the whole time. I don't know what she's talking about. The bottom line is, Alexis is not real. You're That's... talking for a, a year plus to this young man. And the idea was to make a fake profile to talk to guys to see if you can get them to give you money. Yeah. Amanda's being a total bitch and a hater right now. Enough about Amanda. You're the one here who's telling me that you have been scamming lots of guys pretending to be Alexis, then like, then you're the catfish. I'm not innocent, I'm far from innocent, but don't make me look like a f***ing bad person on national TV. Because I can easily just get up and walk away real quick, and I won't care. So you don't care about him at all? I care for him as a friend. You guys were saying, I love you. As a friend, you can't tell a friend you love him? Well, right, but you knew that he was more in love than just like a friend. Yeah, but it was just like, I wanted a friendship. You have to care about him if you, you, a year is a long time to talk to anybody. Really? Oh, I have to? When nobody gets about you, you don't got to care about nobody. You don't know my life story. You don't know what I've been through. I've been through a lot of I've been in the foster care. I've been adopted. I I've been in you. and out of jail since I was 11 years old. OK, I've done it through a lot of OK, I've been through a lot. I've been my ass. I've you. had my ass dragged from one end to the other. OK, if you don't want to talk to me at the end of the day, oh, well, so be it. I'm still going to be me. I'm still going to move on. I'm going to do me and my kids, and that's the bottom lying to it. And if you believe Amanda, then you're dumber than I thought. Oh, my god. But you lied. I honestly don't believe anything that you're saying. I mean, what you did is not OK. Take some responsibility for yourself. You realize what you're doing is really up. I'm done. I'm done with the situation. I'm done. I'm going to walk away, because I'm about to cuss your ass out real quick. So I'm done with this. I don't want to talk about it. Thank you. OK, I'm already done. Just let it be. Just let it be, guys. All right. Here's the plan. Gemini, you're going to hang here with me and Cammy. You guys will be in here. Obviously, you know, we're close, so try not to make any noise. Okay. You don't want to give away yeah. your position. After Gemini and Ashley get a chance to talk for a minute, I'll come in with her. We'll see how that goes. All right? So hang tight. We'll be right outside. Oh, she texted me. She's here. All right. How you feel? My stomach is like... I don't know. Oh. Hello again. Hey, girl. Hey, Miranda. Well, Gemini. Here she is, Miranda, a.k.a. Danielle. Danielle, <laughs> Ashley. Thanks for coming. Yeah. We're really just here to give him an opportunity to get some closure to this whole thing. Well, like, why did you do it in the first place? Like, what is, what was you looking for? Nothing from you. Like, still? Well, did you have feelings? No, no, like, he's, he's a great guy. But he's just got, you know, issues. 
What you think you got? No, I'm just, I'm just saying, like, you're a great guy. You're a great friend. It happened. It was a joke. How the hell it was a joke? Seven years? I, ain't nobody find it funny but you. I only came here today because I wanted to make amends. I've done that, so can I go now? No, I think he had a question. Okay, and I, I'm not answering him because right now it's going to get heated between us. Yeah. Oh, no. like, I don't even care no more. Like, you selfish. I'm just... You don't care about nobody but yourself. He, he's upset, obviously. And I think it's he justified. He's upset. <laughs> we both done. That's a wrap. Let me quickly just talk to Gemini. I'm going to take him inside the room for Please a second. Please do. And cool him off, and then we'll come back out. I'm not doing it this time. If we're going to do this, then I will go back Actually, to the crib. I don't know what you're expecting. <laughs> we got as much from that conversation as we're going to get. You guys can just be here. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm good. I just want to get this over with. I don't care no more. All right, I'm going to go get her, and I'll bring her in. I'll be right back. He's in there. He's calm down. Why don't we go in there and we can try this again? Oh Lord. Oh damn. My is right with Come on in. No, 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 no. They love you and care about you. As you can see, we brought some people here from your life. Mm, that's an animation. Yes. Kind of. You set me up. Well, that's how interventions work. Yeah. Let's have a seat. So look, call it whatever you want. I care about you as a person who exists right now. Obviously, you need to stop the catfishing, but maybe before you can do that, you need to realize that there are people, specifically these two who you've known a long time, mm. who want you to be happy and be honest and live a life that's fulfilling and rewarding. We're here, we want to know how you feel, and we want to be helpful if we can. I love you, but I'm not finna sit here and applaud your bullshit because I know you're better than this. The whole point of being on this show is for these people to get their answers, not for you to come in here and make this a joke and act like this isn't hurting them and like you're just completely deep down okay with what you're doing to these people. What about your real life? Not this person you're pretending to be. All this effort you putting into all these lies, you could put it into finding yourself a real husband, not one that you gotta lie about. Yeah, the smile's gone now, isn't it? And that's coming from me, your big sister, who actually loves you and cares about the real you, not this person you're pretending to be, because it's not OK. It's crazy. All my answer is why. Why you couldn't be yourself? That's one question. He's just asking one. This is a joke. I'm bad. I'm sorry. But that's not a joke. You wasted yeah, seven years of this. this young man's life. I'm not life. doing this. I'm not doing this. Then what you come Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. If you I'm not doing this, boy. It's not boy. I'm not doing this. Ashley, you all right? I'm fine. Sure? I'm fine. She left because she didn't want to start crying because that's where she was headed. Yeah. But what, what happened to you that was so bad for you to do all this to people? You feel like you get attacked? <laughs> yeah, I do. Like, how dare you come here talking about my marriage and you say that bull <laughs> Then you don't know what the I've been going through. Yeah, I get it. I hurt people. I get that. But don't sit up here. Don't talk about what about your husband. Like, don't do that. You know I didn't come here to attack you. It's all about love, baby. That's the thing, though. They ambushed me. Y'all don't know what the I've been going through the last three years. Yeah, I'm right. I'm gonna get this over with because I'm ready to go home. Like, they don't right. know. Like, you don't know what the hell this person put me through these last three years. Well, tell us. We want to know. Don't talk to me right now, Neef. Thank you. OK. In real life, when you're out and about, and somebody were to ask you, do you have a girlfriend, do you say yes? Um, would I say yes if somebody were to ask me about a girlfriend? Um. But you got to think about it, it's fine. Yes. 
Like, guys, I really do love the girl. Don't get me wrong. Like, I, I really don't show my feelings until I know, like, it's genuine. Like, I was scared to get my heart broke, if that makes sense. But, like, I can't, like, when I wanted to meet her, I can't do that on my own. Like, that was a big step for me. Um, I was kind of nervous. And, like, I'm insecure in person. Like, I don't, I, like, I can't do that. <laughs> He's, like, shy. It's cute. But, OK. Aaliyah, talk to me. Kay. Come on, girlfriend. It's hard. Like, when you see somebody for the first time, you know? It's, like, hard not to, like, give in. So you're into it? Yeah, I am. Just from knowing you for the past few days, yeah. you do a lot to make other people feel loved and Did you want to give, 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 give. But, like, how much love are you getting? You're giving all of it. But what are you getting back? I personally don't think that he would have ever actually met up with you Neither. if it wasn't for, for this. this. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. I could see, like, the more he was talking, it was like, this was hard for him. I don't know. Like, I love him. So it's like, more than that. I don't know. It's kind of From the conversations you guys have had, you've talked about wanting to move to California. And, and to, you know, be with her. Yeah, I talked about moving to exactly. L.A. Right. But you didn't imagine moving to L.A. to, like, be in a relationship with her. No, but Fair. it's like 50-50. How serious are you? I'm serious, right? I mean, I love that girl. And uh, I got feelings for her, like, um, I can see myself moving out here with her. So but you I'm want just to make sure to, basically to make this work. Exactly. All right. All right, let me just check in with them, see if I'll, I'll bring her over. Been talking to him, and it sounds to me like he has things he wants to say to you. So why don't we just let them talk, and we'll just kind of leave you guys for a minute. I want to hear. Nervous? nervous. Heck yeah, I'm nervous. Like, what you want to do for it? Like, do you want to be with me? I mean, I want to be with you, obviously. I do. I just don't look dumb. I don't know. It's just like trust is kind of. So what are you willing to do for this relationship? I'm trying to be with you. But like, what are you willing to do? Whatever you ask me to do. That's what I'm, hey, that's why I asked you. Like, what you want me to do? You show your actions, so I don't get hurt. I can show my actions. I like it. So you don't get hurt, you know? Like it. Would you want to move with me for well, LA? Um, I feel like I'll be OK with that. Yeah, we can live together. Leave. What are you talking about? Good. No. It's not good. So do you I like want a hug. Yes, I love you. Come here, give me a hug. Can't believe I get to like I can trust you. Yeah, you can trust me. Still I'm like I'm these me, but it don't get you are. You're so cute. Ding on. All right, you two. No, you're cute. No, you're cute. Okay, let's sit over here for a second <laughs> so we can all sit together. You understand, like, like, she is serious, right? And she doesn't f around. Right. And when she's with someone, she, she, she's really with them, and it means a lot. And from what you're saying, you feel very much the same way. So, like, there's definitely grounds here for some sort of future thing, right? But you're gonna have to prove it, right? You know. I think that you guys because you are so young. You can both come here and make moves and do exactly what it is that you want to do and be in a relationship with each other, but still have your own path. Yeah. Okay. Don't move in together, for Christ's sake, please. I have to say that before I leave. So that's it. All right. In an un, you know. Is this a oh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we let you guys have some time? Good luck. Good luck to you. It was a blessing to you. Is this a big call? To make sure she's okay. I gotta keep my eyes on him at all times. I don't know, I got butterflies in my stomach. Girl, so I'm like, Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Still? I'm just meeting you. Ever had butterflies for the female? Is this a thick call real love?